Are you aware that he did that? I, I didn't know about. I don't know exactly what he's done, but yeah, we're in a real problem with Insure Missouri right now. It's I would say on life support. Um, part of our agreement in the House uh, with, with the governor and his folks uh, was that we would move forward if it included some transparency and competition reform in a state which we think would lower cost and improve care uh, for all Missourians. Uh, we think it's very important to do that just as much as it's important to do. I've, I've said I support the governor's concept of insure Missouri and trying to get more you know, folks insured, but I also think that lowering health care costs would do that as well, and I don't think you can do that without the transparency reforms and the competition reforms like CON that have been proposed. I would like to personally totally do away with CON. I don't think it's, uh, I don't think it's beneficial for health care in our state. Unfortunately, there's you know disagreements on that, so we sat down and uh, Representative Flute came up with, I think, a very good compromise that's a middle-of-the-road uh, plan. Uh, but if I had a meeting with the uh, Missouri Hospital Association representatives, and they basically said they weren't interested in doing any kind of CON this year at all. That was, a, that was an issue for another year, and they weren't going to mess with that, uh, and that if it came up on the floor, they would do everything they could to defeat it. I, w I think they would probably be successful because, you know, people, they do have some clout and expertise in that area. And I said, well, if you're you know, going to take that approach, then it's probably best for us not to waste everybody's time and even bring the bill up for, uh, you know, for, those, for those discussions. So at this point, I'd say we're stalled on Insure Missouri. And uh, you know, at this time, late date, uh, every day you're stalled is a pretty good chance that the bill's not going to make it. So would you say that uh, Dempsey's bill in the Senate is a non-starter because there's not enough significant certificate of need in there? There's, yes, absolutely. So why do you think the Senate is pursuing a bill that they probably know isn't going to be passed. Well, I don't know. I, I can't speak for the Senate. I mean, mm -hmm. I think they're probably trying to pursue a bill. I, I don't know that they know everything. You know, we have our own opinions in the House. They have theirs in the Senate. We feel CON is a significant portion of, uh, of, of moving forward to help uninsured Missourians.